Hey everybody, King Size Customs here for another custom car video. This was the 76 or 77 Chevrolet Camaro. And I wanted to customize it to look a little bit like a car from one of my video games. Those of you who've ever played True Crime uh, New York City remember that this was uh, the car that Marcus drove. Wasn't as nice, I think. I don't think it had the hood. I know it didn't have the hood scoop. I know it didn't have the um, roll cage. But he drives one of these in the beginning. And then there was a clean variation of it. And there was the dirty, rusted variation of it. Now, I know you guys are going to comment. The rust doesn't look that real. I'm still playing around with the rusting techniques. I think the best way to go is probably the Tamiya powders. So, oh, I found them on eBay. I'll probably pick them up sooner or later, but um, let's go into it a little bit more. So, this is an almond color. This is a satin finish paint, but I used flat clear coat to make it look a little bit more rusty and busty. Well, rusted and busted, but um, kind of hard to tell. I did the taillights. I used a, I actually used my little chrome pen that wasn't the Molotov, it's like Craftsmart, but I think those came out pretty good. Um, let's try to get in a little bit more light. So, yeah, there you go, that's better. So you can see they're kind of like, they're dark, but you can see they're there. The sunlight gets brighter out of my window. Um, Phantom is just a little graffiti, uh, a smashed out turn signal. That's why it's all like blocked out. Um, this is the part I'm really disappointed in. I think it's because I'm using old paint and I didn't tape it off too well, but you can tell the headlights are there. There's one turn signal, but again, it's just white, not yellow. The grill detail kind of got covered in the paint. So it's more of an artistic rusting than really a real rusting. Um, the technique I did on Paul Wooten's station wagon was probably a better technique. So uh, another huge announcement. I just got my degree. My degree came in the mail on the 3rd of July. Those of you who follow me on uh, Facebook and Instagram know that I had just gotten that on the 3rd of July. Um, I'm also an uncle for the third time. Which is super awesome. Uh, my nephew was born a few days ago. So I'm an uncle for the third time. Uh, something that you all probably care about five times more than the past couple of things I had just said. Videos are going to come back on a regular schedule. I'm still looking for a job. Um, the reason why videos have slowed down was I had to get an eye surgery. I had to get my stint. I had to get another stint. Knock on wood. Um, I've gone through all my post-op, uh, appointments. My last one was July 6th. Um, he actually gave me three weeks off as of the last appointment. So I see him soon. And then, um, I was told I can pretty much, I'm healing nicely just to relax and heal. So don't overdo it. I was afraid to use my drill after surgery and after a couple of the appointments, until the very last one. So now I'm just drilling cars apart and just going to try to do it how I used to do it back in the old days, you know, try to do a car a day. That's my little challenge to myself because I had a lot of fun doing that. And I think my skills got a little bit better from last year. So, well, all right, guys, I'll see you in the next one and see you later.